Some of us often fall for the belief that talent wins championships. In a way, it does. But teamwork is truly the key to winning it all. I mean, come on. The 2011 New York Giants went 9-7 and seven only to end up Super Bowl 46 champions. But there are a number of sports teams that no matter how many great players they have, they're unable to get over the hump. I'm Justin Fraction, and today we present 10 teams that have great players but can't win titles. And a big thanks and shout out to Samuel Flores for suggesting this list. We do hope you enjoy this video, and if you do, feel free to click subscribe down below for more cool videos every single day. Number 10. Memphis Grizzlies The Grizzlies have been among the top teams in the Western Conference this decade. They have a superstar in Zach Randolph, who's always a threat to score 20 points per game. He's complemented by one of the league's best defensive players in Marc Gasol, the 2013 NBA Defensive Player of the Year. But despite making the playoffs every year since 2011, with 350-win seasons, Memphis hasn't had much playoff success. 2013 was the one time this core got past the second round of the playoffs. All talent, no titles. Number 9. Liverpool FC While this team wasn't able to go anywhere with one of England's finest goal scorers in Steven Gerrard, they truly wasted his prime years in so many ways. Now this team belongs to Sadio Mane, but it looks like the man is going to need a lot of help if his club is to get through the top class of EPL teams. Liverpool has not won a league championship in over two decades. All talent and hype, but not much action to show for it. Number 8. Montreal Canadiens Carey Price is hands down the best hockey goalie in the world. We try not to even question that. This team had a perennial Norris Trophy candidate, P.K. Subban, before trading him away in 2016. And though they have a consistent 30-40 goal scorer in Max Pacioretty, plus other good role players. But every year the Habs make the playoffs, they always go out in lackluster fashion. They haven't reached nor won the Stanley Cup since 1993. Time to break that funk, boys. There's a lot of talent to make it happen. Number 7. Kansas City Chiefs Say what you want about Alex Smith, but the man is a good enough quarterback to win titles. He is the pure game manager many teams need. Jamal Charles was among the league's flashiest running backs for several years and has since signed with the Denver Broncos. And this offense currently has a top five tight end in Travis Kelsey. On the defensive side of the ball, Marcus Peters is making his case as the league's best cornerback. And we won't go without mentioning world-class safety Eric Berry. Throw in that lethal pass rush, and we don't know how the Chiefs haven't even made the AFC Championship with this roster. It's beyond us. Will they ever win a championship? It's a question we can only ponder for now. Number 6. Toronto Raptors The Raptors were once nothing more than the only NBA team that didn't play in America. Then they got themselves one of the league's top scorers in DeMar DeRozan, a guy who isn't a stranger to 30 and 40 point games. And oh, Kyle Lowry is totally one of the best and most skilled point guards in the league. But the Raptors were eliminated in the opening round of the 2014 and 15 playoffs. They barely, by a finger, reached the Eastern Conference Finals in 2016. They're hands down a top five team in the East. But unless LeBron James chooses to retire early, this core probably won't win a title. Number 5. Dallas Cowboys We know, we know, Dak Prescott took over as the quarterback in 2016 and is just getting started. But Tony Romo was also a very good quarterback that was capable of winning championships. He had one of the NFL's most elite wide receivers in Des Bryant, a future Hall of Fame tight end in Jason Witten, and the best offensive line in the league. Dallas' defense isn't great, but Sean Lee is a game-changer at linebacker. But Dallas hasn't reached the NFC Championship game in over two decades. Hence, they can't win Super Bowls with such a talented roster. At least Jerry Jones owns a nice stadium. Number 4. Los Angeles Dodgers The Dodgers took home the NL West crown in 2013, 14, 15, and 16. They were led by Cy Young winner Clayton Kershaw, who was by far the best pitcher in all of baseball. Before Zach Greinke left after the 2015 season, he and Kershaw formed baseball's best 1-2 pitching combo. And their lineup is no joke either, with longtime MVP candidate Adrian Gonzalez slugging homers and Corey Sager quickly becoming one of the next top stars in baseball. But the Dodgers haven't reached the World Series since winning it all in 1988. They'd reached the NLCS in 2016, but it's time to get over that hump. Number 3. Arizona Cardinals Ah, so you have the best wide receiver of this generation in Larry Fitzgerald and his 1,000 receiving yards every year. You have one of the league's top five cornerbacks in Patrick Peterson. You have arguably the league's best safety in Tyran Matthew as well. And OK Carson Palmer is a pretty above average quarterback, but Arizona hasn't been able to win a championship with this core. Even with running back David Johnson becoming one of the league's most explosive offensive players, this Cardinals offense falls apart in the playoffs, big time. Will they ever come around? We'll see. Bottom line, they haven't done so yet. Number 2. Los Angeles Clippers Chris Paul has been one of the league's best point guards for over a decade, averaging nearly 20 points per game throughout his career. 
Blake Griffin can take over a game like few others as he has no problem putting up over 20 points and close to 10 rebounds per game. And DeAndre Jordan is no slouch himself. There's your big three. And yet this Clippers team hasn't been able to reach the third round of the postseason yet. There is championship caliber talent, but no titles to show for it. Perhaps this core will never win a championship together. And number one, Washington Capitals. Alexander Ovechkin leads the NHL in goals just about every year, putting up 50 a season with ease. And his counterpart, Nicholas Backstrom, can put up over 70 points a season. Not an issue. Braden Holtby is a top three goalie in the NHL as well. The Capitals also have plenty of depth on their blue line, and defense does win championships. Yet, despite making the playoffs all but one year from 2008 to 16, Washington never advanced past the second round of the postseason, even after being the top seed in the East three times. Will this core ever win a championship together? Time is running out. What other teams have great players but can't win titles? Join us in the comments section below. If you like this video and learned a thing or two, clicking the like button helps us out a ton and we appreciate it. If this is your first time coming around to Total Pro Sports though, subscribing is a great idea because we put out videos like this every single day. But as always, thanks for watching and we'll see you guys next time.